Samantha Wills started out with just a few dollars in her pocket selling jewellery at the local markets. Today, her designs are worn by some of the world's leading ladies and business turnover has topped the million dollar a year mark. Here's how she did it. Perfect. It literally has been a whirlwind of success. She's smart, sassy and sexy. I still pinch myself, I'm, I'm very lucky. Hi, I'm Samantha Wills with Tito TV and we're here tonight at the Royal Hall of Industries for the opening night of Art Sydney 06. Tonight we're going to catch up with some exhibitors, artists and guests at tonight's show. Fashion commentator Melissa Hoyer says Samantha is set to be Australia's next big thing. Samantha's doing some really great stuff. It's a very, very tough market. I mean, other Aussies have done it. Sass and Bide, Colette Dinnigan and Elle, of course. Yeah, Elle McPherson Intimates has become uh, sort of globally recognised. We're very successful in the UK. We've just launched in America. And so has Samantha Wills. <gasps> She's shooting her new campaign in the city that never sleeps. Central Park is very cold, it's about four degrees here today, so um, a bit chilly, but it's, it's going really well. Hi, I'm Samantha Wills, the new guest reporter for The Footy Show. Now we all know that rugby league players have a tendency to be a little rough around the edges at times, so it's my job to help them out in the style department. My first victim is Bulldogs halfback, Daniel Holdsworth. Hey Dan, I'm Samantha. Hello Samantha, how are you? I'm good, thank you. You are a very brave man coming in here today. Let's go through and meet the team in the salon. No worries. Well, I do have to ask this on behalf of the women of Australia. Are you single or spoken for? No, I'm actually single. Now, one last question though. You were part of the Sexiest Man in League a few seasons back. If you could nominate another Bulldog, who would you nominate and why? Thanks for bringing that up, by the way. That's a winner, yeah. I like it. What do you think? I like the black. Yeah, Turn. it's me. Yeah, very cool. Good answer. Well Dan, we've had a really successful day. Been at the salon, got you some new clothes. What do you think of your new look? Yeah, it's alright, it was a bit different. <laughs> it was fun, but yeah, I like the gear, so yep. all good. Well, thank you so much for being involved. Guys, my work here today is done. I'll see you next time literally is just go, go, go. So um, getting a taxi on the street, that's probably been the hardest thing I've been here. But that's as hard as it gets for Samantha. And it's easy to see why this humble entrepreneur is fast becoming an inspiration. You can do anything that you want to do. Um, so, I mean, I wasn't the smartest kid at school. You get knocked over so many times, but you just got to keep getting back up, dusting yourself off and moving forward with it. Um, in business, I guess, and as the company continues to grow, I've learnt very quickly, you just have to believe in yourself and just take the plunge. You know, if I can do it, anyone can do it. Hey, go girl. And the good news keeps coming for Samantha. She's just been named the new face of New South Wales tourism, her home state.